Well, if you've been taking advantage of expired parking meters during the last seven months of no parking enforcement in the city of San Diego, your time is officially up. Enforcement is back as of today, and our Kasha Gregorczyk is live downtown with all the details. Kasha. Kathleen and Andrew, we've talked about this time and time again, uh, even with the last announcement on October 1st that enforcement was coming back. There was still a two week grace period where just warnings were handed out. Those warnings are officially over as of today. So the question is, were people prepared? I wasn't aware that it was back on. I did not know they were going back into reinforcement. After a seven month hiatus, parking enforcement is back in the city of San Diego. I have heard that. I didn't know it was today. I thought it was actually, I, I thought it was October 1st. The city made the announcement October 1st and followed it up with an additional two weeks of warnings. It's easy to get a ticket down here. As of Thursday, enforcement is officially back on, but some residents still feel the city could have done more to alert the public. They have the signs for like two hour parking, no parking here, but they don't have anything that's saying, hey, we are now back to actually reinforcing these meters. With limited enforcement over the last several months, time limits for meters and curbs have virtually been non-existent. It is going to catch people off guard because I saw people take advantage of the ability to kind of leave your car for longer periods of time. And absolutely, that is the right thing to do, considering people are working from home more often. They don't have the ability to put their car different places. There's too many people in San Diego. There's not enough parking. So when this whole thing was happening and the parking wasn't enforced, I was like, this is perfect. I can park wherever I want. Not exactly wherever you want. Citations have been and will continue to be issued for those parked illegally at red, white and blue painted curbs. And as one final reminder, all other rules are now being enforced. And the city has repeatedly said bringing back enforcement is a big step forward in bringing back the city's economy. So if you're wondering just how much money parking citations generate in revenue for the city, the city tells us the last fiscal year before the pandemic, they generated more than $20 million from parking citations. Reporting live downtown, Kasha Gregorczyk, Fox 5 News.